Hi, my name is Doug Brooks, and I wrote The Death of the Sun. My book is about uh, a character named Benjamin Crichton, who developed his own technology, and he's been uh, traveling through wormholes for years in secret, without the government knowing about it. <laughs> and uh, for the first time, he decides to enlist his son to help him, and his son uh, is assigned a mission for the first time, and his dad tells him not to fight anybody else's war. But when he comes to this planet, he's really tested by what he finds. He meets a, an enemy that uh, is like nothing they've ever seen before. And he's uh, enslaved a group of people that live there on the planet. And uh, his uh, promise to his father is really challenged. Kron's tail is within striking distance. It whips around with great speed. It is coming at eye level for Derek's head, and he moves out of the way at the last possible second as the tip of the tail gouges the wall. Sparks fly everywhere as the tough crystalline tip penetrates the wall's material. It is like a hot knife going through butter. What inspired me to write this book is that uh, I really wanted to write a good book that was really had an amazing story and uh, also kept you guessing and also made you really want to wonder what was going to happen next. Uh, really surprise them and uh, hope they enjoy a lot of the technologies that's showcased in this book. And there's a lot more to come in the other two books as well. Derek watches as the creature edges closer to him, sniffing the air as he moves. Suddenly, as soon as Calicron's tail is within striking distance, it whips around with great speed.